Happy Queen of Clubs week! Uh, it's Monday morning. Uh, I got up super early because I was like finishing a report. I really wanted to finish yesterday and I just wasn't capable of doing it. So I did it this morning. The alarm went at four o'clock. <laughs> so now it's half past eight. Uh, I'm gonna get ready now to go to work and I have a lot more stuff to do uh, today and tomorrow. There's a lot of calls now that I'm back in. It's not employment I'm in, but basically I'm part of a team again that's in a company. So there's a lot of calls, which I'm not really used to anymore. <laughs> a lot of conference calls and uh, meetings. So there's a lot of that today and I just want to finish a lot of stuff. And then later this week there's some exciting travels coming up. Um, so up until then though, grinding work. See ya! So most people have hair on their head. I have spider webs that defy gravity. Morning, friends. Uh, it's Friday, Friday, Friday. Uh, I have a couple of things to do, um, so I'm going to run those errands now um, before I continue work. It's crazy. I have so much stuff to do, which is great. Uh, I like being busy, and I don't like downtime. Um, but it's a, it's a lot right now. Um, my duties basically officially start today, but obviously there's normal life and other clients to take care of as well. Um, so yeah, so I'm walking to do a couple of things and I'll show you where I am here in Bansko. Okay, well, well never mind. <laughs> Like two things I wanted to try so far were both fails. The optician, I want to get new glasses, who's still closed, it's too early. And the doctor, uh, so I got the email that my name was changed, at least I thought that's what it meant. But it hasn't been changed, so on the vaccine paper, um, my name is written wrong and they have to make it correct, because otherwise I can't travel with it. I still have time, but like I'm going to Varna uh, tomorrow for a week, um, so it's going to be a little longer till I can go and get it. Uh, anyway, so two fails. Let's see if this third one is also going to be a fail. As expected, uh, three tries, uh, three tasks and three fails. Um, it's a bit of a shame because like um, uh, Petit Nicola is really, really good. It's a really good bakery. Um, he, he does an amazing job with all the stuff that he's uh, putting up there. Unfortunately, <laughs> he's not very consistent with opening hours. So, um, so it's always a bit of a chance uh, that he's open. Thing is, I owe him for lever because last time he didn't have changed. But now he's not open, so I have to go back some other time. Guys, <laughs> so much going on. So I was at the barbecue and it was awesome. Um, I had some food, there was a lot of people because in like two weeks there's the um, Nomad Fest. Uh, at the Nomad Fest I'm going to do a talk as well and, and a lot of people coming. So it's like 350 people are going to be at the Nomad Fest. So people start to arrive. It's very busy, and but the thing is, there's so many like really interesting people coming. So I just sat together with uh, polyglots. So <laughs> people that speak like 30 languages. It's like, what? <laughs> so we had like really fascinating uh, conversations about languages and it's just, uh, it's just amazing. 
guys, if you don't travel, whatever it needs, whatever it takes, go travel and meet other people. Like the stuff you learn about the world and about people, it's just absolutely amazing. Okay, but now I have to go to bed because tomorrow at 6.45 in the morning, we're going to get on the road to Varna and the Black Sea. So I arrived in Varna, but more precisely in Golden Sands. Um, this is like the party area apparently in, in Varna and at the Black Sea. Uh, I booked a, a room with Sea View. Unfortunately, it's uh, very disappointing. So technically, that's Sea View, but <laughs> that's not what I had expected. So I'm probably going to say something. Uh, but otherwise, yeah, it looks quite, quite cool. So I have the bed here. Um, nice couch, um, fridge, that's always helpful, microwave, and well, the bathroom looks like this. Right. So this I booked through Expedia and it was uh, 200 pounds for a week. Um, so it's not crazy, but um, yeah. Also not the cheapest, I think, but it's all right. I'll figure it out if I'm going to complain about the <laughs> sea view uh, or if I just roll with it. I mean, I really have to work a lot anyway, and we're going to go to the casino and the beach is right there. So we're going to check that out in a bit, but I'm just going to rest for a couple of minutes. Oh, and if I say we, I mean, I'm here with two friends and they have another friend uh, who's here. So we're four girls and two of us are poker players. So we're going to check out the casino in a bit as well. friends uh, it is Sunday last day of the week but as you already know this is a two-week vlog I have so much going on and I, I can't film a lot so that this is going to be wrapped up in one vlog one video um, yeah yesterday we were at the casino I didn't play any cash game I played <laughs> video poker the thing is like on their website they said they would have a one pound one pound uh, no, why am I saying pound one euro one euro uh, cash game going um, but they only had one three and that's a bit high for me <laughs> in euros. This it's like almost like a two five dollars um, It doesn't mean that the players are necessarily that good, but I just don't have that kind of money I don't have a bankroll so all money I put at the poker table is real money So I was really tired so I decided not to risk it not to go at the poker table But I sat down at the video poker and at the video poker I made sixty seven dollars euros god. This is so confusing. I'm in a country that doesn't have the euro you know, there's like lever and not euros, but still the casino works in euros. Anyway, so that was nice. I uh, had some food afterwards and uh, now I've just been working. It's Sunday, I've been working. Um, and yeah, so there's a little bit of sun today, but otherwise the weather is just really not nice. Um, so whenever there was sun on my balcony, I just sat and held my face up in the uh, sun. But as you can see, I didn't get proper color or anything um, so yeah I keep trying I'm here for the whole week uh, so whenever I can film something I will do that but there won't be probably that many updates because work 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 <laughs> hey guys a quick update once again it's good to book with Expedia <laughs> um, I did complain um, with the hotel when I arrived that my sea view was a sea glimpse 
at the most. And that, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to see view. That's why I booked that. And uh, when I said that in the beginning, they tried to upsell me to a, a bigger room or like an apartment, basically. And I said, I don't want to pay more. I want sea view. <laughs> so then they were like, mm -hmm. so I wrote Expedia and said, listen, guys, this is not what you sold me. You sold me sea view. This is not sea view, right? So they then got in touch with the marketing department of this hotel. The, they got in touch with the management. And now they offered me all of a sudden the apartment with sea view. It's not like there's not a lot of sea view either here but it's still better because i have to sit in the room quite a bit to work and i wanted to like you know have the opportunity to sit on the balcony look at the sea and do some work and when i don't see the sea that's not the point of it anyway so i turn the camera around and show you so yeah as you can see <laughs> not a lot more sea but i see the sea and the benefits are also, I mean, I already made a mess here, but this is uh, a kitchen, but it doesn't have any cooking, unfortunately. I thought this would be also a way that I could cook some eggs in the morning or so, but no. But it has a separate bedroom, where in the other one, it was a studio, um, I had the bed in the living room, and the bathroom is a little bigger as well. Um, so yeah, nice, but it's still not... Again, like, but I think this is a known issue like with a lot of places that they sell you sea view and it, uh, it doesn't really work out with the sea view. So I'm happy with this now. This should be all right. And it's once again, uh, you know, they always want you to book through their own website or b directly with the hotel. But then if I had done that, I wouldn't have had any negotiation grounds for a complaint. They would have just gone, oh, you can't. And they lied, basically. You know, they told me and um, they didn't have rooms available that they could have given me when I checked in. <laughs> and that's not true because um, they wanted to upsell me. So I know that there were rooms available. So anyway, so not that happy with that situation. Anyway, so now I'm gonna get ready, have a bit of rest and then uh, go with the girls to do something, something along the promenade. morning um, it's Saturday and we have to leave the sea um, it was really nice I was unfortunately super busy with work but I could enjoy a little bit especially yesterday 
um, we did decide to go to a different kind of base and so not this one here and uh, we found like this super fancy place with like tattooed statues and so on and we had the bay to ourselves I even went in the water a bit and I had some really nice food um, so it was a perfect like uh, finish oh yeah and then I went to play poker so I finally got a chance to play 1-3 here and uh, just a short session lost 70 euros so it wasn't like wasn't good but then uh, I also saw that they had these old school slot machines you know where you use the coins um, so that was fun to try that out so wasted a little money there. and I actually won I won a little bit there but then I lost that video poker <laughs> Anyway, it was a good finish and we're gonna um, go back to Bansko today and next week is gonna be um, Bansko Nomad Fest uh, so that's a lot of stuff going on um, but I might check in with you tomorrow so let's just say see you tomorrow and see the drive now back to Bansko it will be probably beautiful So it's the end of the week and I'm ending the week in a very weird way. There's so many people here, but I got this. I'm going to speak at the Nomad Fest. It starts tomorrow. So tomorrow's the official start, but today is the welcome drinks. Never seen that many people here and it's crazy. Um, but yeah, so that's the end of uh, not just this week, but the last two weeks. I say goodbye. Don't forget to like and subscribe, especially if you want to see the Nomad Fest happenings next week and also my talk about effective decision-making, learnings through poker. See you. Bye!